Yes, yes, y'all. We got my son helping us out today with another Diablo Immortal video. This is Iconic. This is Tavion. All right. Um, we're going to get into it here in just a second. I'm going to see if I can get him back upstairs. But we're going to be taking a look at the new chest for Demon Hunter. Uh, it's got a weird name, uh, Primordial Ooze or Order. I don't even know. Uh, it turns knockback shot into like a, a flamethrower. So we're going to be looking at that. And then I think something that pairs well with it is the new pants for Knife Trap. So we're going to be taking a look at that inside of a challenge riff here and going through what I call the Whirlwind Demon Hunter build. Let's get it. When you got a two-year-old, this is bound to happen. Let's see if he's going to watch his blippy. Got the dog in here with me too. Everybody's just trying to get a piece of Iconic today. <laughs> All right, he's preoccupied. Now we're back to our regularly scheduled program. I forgot where I left off at, but I think I'm supposed to be showing you guys the build. If I show it to you twice by accident, my bad. So we've got our home doing knockback shot damage increased by 19%. We've got the new chest piece that makes knockback shot a flamethrower. Also increases knockback shot damage by 18%. And I have this piece awakened, so it's another 10%. So this should be doing a pretty good amount of damage we're also going to be trying out the new uh, knife trap pants hook chain knife trap now places a trap filled with hook chains when triggered hook chains explode from the trap damaging and pulling all nearby enemies together to immobilize them and then we've added in knife trap explosions also shatter the enemy's armor increasing damage taken by 19 percent and i think this might be a newer one too as well and we're going to add strafe in, so duration increased by 39%. Movement speed increased by 30% while using strafe. Strafe uh, throws explosive grenades. And after knockback shot, your damage is increased by 10% for 4.8 seconds. I don't know if these are going to override each other. I don't think they will. But we're going to try this out, see how it goes. We're going to hop into a challenge riff. And we're also going to be using shadow sight to increase our movement speed. Nice, we got a yellow. Let's try to gather up a little pack here. Oh, we got some elites too. Oh, they're trying to trap me. <laughs> All right, so what we're gonna do here, we're gonna let off Shadow Sight. We're gonna lay down a couple of traps and we're gonna world win. For any stragglers, they can get the grenades. You know, this is, I know it's a meme build, but this is kind of funny. I meant fun. Very interesting. <laughs> Let's see if we can get another big pack here. All right, they're coming. Healed. Let's get these guys. You know, this knife trap does some crazy damage. <laughs> hey, we got the whirlwind demon hunter for real. This, this might not be that bad of a build. Now, the one thing that's wrong with this flamethrower is the range on it. So, I mean, we're not trying to get this close, typically, as a demon hunter. But... It's doing some damage, and so is that knife trap. Yeah, I could see that knife trap being useful in PvP. Alright, let's see how we deal with the boss here. Should just be straight burning them. <laughs> now, I don't know about it being great damage for the boss, but. That is uh, actually a fun build. What is it, like a 
a demolitionist, a bomb bombardier, a grenadier, a grenader. What you call them, people? And let's take this over to the realm of damnation here, real quick. Do a couple laps and just see how it performs in a farm. Not a great farming build. <laughs> if the name of the game here wasn't speed though, I mean this this is a pretty fun build. Not gonna lie. I don't know what the practical application of this build is, but it is fun. crits look like. So the idea here is you want to get a frenzy shrine and then you're good to go. It melts everything. Let me know what you think about this build. I have no idea what I think about it. It actually is fun. I mean, if this was somehow a viable build for the game, I, I can't say I wouldn't love to play this. Like, it's, it's kind of fun. But in all practical applications compared to what you do as a demon hunter, this makes no sense whatsoever. But as always, let me know in the comments what you think like subscribe all that good stuff and i'm gonna catch y'all in the next one